the Espresso TV watches, uh, we found something very interesting. A uh, roaster for home use with a roasting app. And a uh, robot from Mikawa is uh, presenting just a mini roast. Exactly, yes. Well, this is actually our professional version, so it's more used as a sample roast in the industry. We are working towards maybe releasing a home version this month. So let's, we're going to roast some Tanzania Burka natural yeah. coffee. Um, so we put the coffee in here, it's about 50 grams, 60 grams of green, so that we are left with about um, 50 grams of roasted coffee. And the machine is like, it can operate standalone, but we can also completely make a roast profile on the uh, iPad. Okay. Yeah, so that means we can uh, define the temperature, it's this axis, yeah. and the time here. And the app you uh, can download. The app you, if you buy a machine, you can download the app. Okay, cool. Yeah, and what you do here is you, we can say, well, for this coffee, let's uh, roast it a little bit darker, so we make it a bit longer than the previous one, slightly higher temperature. We want it to start maybe at a lower temperature, so the drying process sort of yeah. starts a little bit slower. We don't bake it. Uh, we can define those parameters. We can, we can make it much longer. You know, we can completely change the profile. But let's stick to something like that we tried before. So we get a good okay, result. Yeah. You can define the airflow here as well. So it depends a bit yeah. on what you want to have. And now I'm just going to send this profile to the roaster. So it's connected to okay. Bluetooth. Say update. And it's now on the roaster. And then the only thing we do is just say start. And then that's your question. Now it's just going to heat up. And you see here this yellow point is going up. That's the measured temperature. So that's the temperature we get from the probes. And when that temperature matches the starting temperature of the rose, it will tell us. The light will start to flash just in a few seconds. Uh, this will start to flash and then we can load the beam. Okay, cool, yeah. So very soon. Yeah, quite soon. Like the end will go slowly because it wants to be yeah. very precise. Like we did a lot okay. of testing. <laughs> we did a lot yeah. of testing to make it precise. Yeah. So it's even gone up to uh, almost 4,000 meters. So we could also you know, test the altitude. Wow. Because some of our customers take it in a suitcase yeah. to, uh, you know, to Colombia, Africa, so they can actually roast with the growers as well. Okay, okay. So now it's ready. Special. So what we do is. We just load the beans into the roasting chamber. Yes. Yeah. Like close it, and now it's just going to start. It. So on the iPad, you see the temperature drop. The temperature drops yeah. down. This can be quite a lot. The beans absorb the heat. Then. Exactly. Yeah. Absorb the heat, and now the drying process sort of slowly starts. Yeah. So you see the temperature rise, and if it's up here, it will start to follow the line that we program. Cool. But I can also show you one, like when you are roasting, you can still change it. So it's not that, you know, this is manual. You wait for, so we can still change it manually. I will, I will show you. Yeah. The machine has also got a built in chat filter. So it's a cyclone. You know, yeah. with the, pro, like the big roasting yeah. machine, got this big cyclone. We made it very small. That's in here. And that means that all the chat and the particles are all. And okay, okay, yeah, that's very good. And it also means that the smoke that comes out of our machine is, is much lower than the model devices. And at the same time, we don't need a filter. Yeah, I so guess. yeah, the smelling is not uh, intense. Well, you get a nice smell, but you yeah. don't get the smoke. Yeah, you don't yeah, get yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. The dirty smell. Yeah. Cool. So you can film in here. It's a little bit dirty because we've done like, so many rows today, yesterday. Maybe you can clean it out very yeah. easily. Let me show you that as well. So you see there's like the skin parts are like... Yeah. Oh, no. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, it's really amazing technique. How long is it on the market? Uh, well, we are actually launching this product here now. So yeah. we, we've, we've... Brand new. It, it is brand new. We have... Like we've made about 30 machines before that we tested with uh, well, either cafes, yeah. also, but also mainly like big roasting companies or smaller like traders yeah. that are using it as a quality control with a sample. 
So, you know, over the years we developed, it's already like the past two years, so we've been working with them very closely to make sure that the technology is, you know, that it's durable and that it's very solid, uh, which they are now. And, uh, and also to understand how people would use it. Sure, sure, yeah. Use it. So I could also, now I could just start to edit it. Like for instance, if, you know, if I'm like, well, let's make it a little bit shorter. Or let's go let the temperature go up a little bit. I could just change it here on the app. Yeah. Say update. Now you will see that it will start to match the line again. So the temperature is going to increase. Yeah, exactly. That's what's happening here. So I can add a bit of heat. Like this. Yeah, yeah. So you mean this is a real professional system? Yeah, this is really not, like the, the yeah. Not yeah. like some cheap uh, rubbish roasters or. Uh, well, like it, we, we really made it like as a yeah. sample roaster. So yes, you, yeah. We made it basically. One of the big reasons for it was that with the traditional probat systems, you uh, you know you do it by hand, which is great because it gives you the sort of crafts. Yeah, yeah. But the problem is especially if. So what happened there now? The light came on. Yeah, sorry. It's now it's cooling down. But that's the end. We did a very short roast now, just for demonstration. But actually, roasts typically are quite short. But sorry, what I was going to say was like we uh, we wanted to make the roasting process very consistent, so you can repeat what you did before, uh, and also you can do a roast in your office in uh, you know roasting companies, so yeah. office like in Geneva. And this is also the top is also. Oh, attenzione, per favore. The oven is classic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it, it's roasting, you know. It's not a fridge or something. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Okay. No, no, it's uh, my bad. Um, and uh, so this way you can repeat exactly. They can, re they can make a profile in Geneva, send it to Addis Ababa, send it to Seattle. Yeah, wonderful. So I'm uh, really impressed and uh, yeah, so I guess soon you will see this new product on our website, okay? <laughs> Grazie mille. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Ciao. But yeah, yeah, yeah. just so if you come back yeah. in, uh, in like yeah. 20 seconds, then uh, yeah. Yeah. we can get the beans out. Okay, okay. Yeah, sure. Without burning... Uh, Without burning hands. <laughs> Now, Martin, so be careful. Maybe it's difficult to see. Is it, is it, can you see the beans? If you go up a bit higher. Yes, so now I'm just going to shoot the beans out. And then start to blow. And then the end of here as well. So you normally use two jars one for the chaff. Yeah. It's really crazy stuff, you know? It's cool. It's so easy to go down. That's it again. It's hot. <laughs> yeah, don't talk. <laughs> okay. It's fine. <laughs> really? Really? It's fine. Yeah, okay. okay. Test. Yeah, perfetto. <laughs> cool, grazie. And you know, this way you can yeah. have like all your rose products yeah. in the air. Yeah, just show once again. Yeah. Oh, sorry. So you, you have a library of like different profiles in there. Okay. You can add more. You can also share them. So if you have yeah. a profile, you want to email it to, you know, to somebody else. Yeah. So you yeah. write this profile, you, you can just email it. Uh, my colleague Wanda is from Holland. Cool. And then open it. Uh, but I'm working on the Wonderful.